All right, so one question we get asked all the time at Black Diamond Junk Removal is, what happens to the items once we remove it from your home or business? One of three things is gonna happen. It's either gonna be donated, recycled, or disposed of. Donations can be household goods, furniture, clothes, appliances. Just let us know in advance if you want the items donated, that we can plan a route efficiently for a truck to stop at a donation center right after your job, but also that way we can coordinate with the donation center to make sure they have space on their loading dock and that they want the items that we're gonna be bringing in. So that's donations. Recycling could be metal or cardboard along with other items. Uh, so plastic, if we get a lot of plastic all at once, we do have resources um, to move large amounts of commodities to get them recycled. And then the third thing is disposal. So most of the items we take does eventually end up in the landfill. Uh, it's either municipal solid waste landfill, uh, MSW, which is the vast majority of our waste, or CND, construction demolition landfills. Um, so municipal solid waste would be typical household trash, same place garbage trucks go to. We would take those to licensed disposal sites. Uh, construction demolition waste is a little bit more processed. It can, some of the other items could be pulled out of those piles to be recycled once it's at a CND landfill. That's part of the cost of our, comp our, of our service. People always ask why it's so expensive. A lot of our cost, about 10% of our revenue goes towards disposal, um, it's expensive to operate landfills, so that cost is passed on to us. But we, we do use only licensed disposal sites. If you, if you choose block time and junk removal, uh, we'll take care of it. We'll follow all EPA regulations. Uh, again, uh, donated, recycled, or disposed of. We do have a priority to recycle and, and donate stuff rather than dispose it, but most of it does end up in the landfill.